Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. Today's video, I have the Educator++ Plus Plus robot. What I want to do today is, if you looked at that website, there were some attachments. Really easy to put on and take off attachments. So today what I want to do is take you to the Cargo Connect table where you can see this robot be able to do those missions with these attachments. So again, really easy to put on and really easy to take back off again. So if you want to see all of that, stay with me. Hino Lego Robotics. Okay guys, so I'm going to leave you a link again to the building instructions of this Educator++ Plus Plus robot. And within that link, it also gives you the instructions on making these attachments. So no, I'm not trying to sell you the instructions. I just know that a lot of times when you're doing first Lego League, your robot is one of the toughest decisions. Like, what do we make? I really, really like this robot. It's compact, it's solid. And again, the worst part with First Lego League is your attachments, how long it takes to put on and take off. Look how easy this is. This is just a regular, you know, lifting or, you know, dropping down attachment. So there is the part that this goes on to right here. And these pins allow you to put this on and take off without it coming off. So that's how easy that is. So lifting. And so if you don't want to, you know, you want to switch it out, you just pull and it comes off. Put it back on again and it just slides back on again. So that's why I love this thing. So today, um, you already want to see, you know, you've already seen some of these in action um, in the previous video. So today, I'm going to be using some different attachments. So I got this attachment for the bridge. And I have another attachment that's going to be used for the switch engine. So it's a really cool, you know, exploring, being able to see how things work and using this Educator++ Plus Plus robot. So let's go ahead and take this and our attachments over to the table. Oh, yeah. Okay, guys, for this attachment here, for the Educator++, Plus Plus, it's going to be, let me pop this off for you. So it's going to allow this to freely move around like this. It used two of these wheel rims and I put some, it, I think these are Inventor or Spike Prime. So what this is gonna do is this will go inside of this gear system right there and it will be able to spin. And again, the cool thing is you just pop this right onto that and this is going to be able to freely move. So we're now going to be able to take this robot here and this attachment over to the switch engine so it can rotate the switch engine. So let's check that out. Okay guys, so we have another attachment here for the Educator++, Plus Plus. so let's go ahead and we don't need this attachment anymore. We did the switch engine, so again, this one pops off. And now, I made this one here. This one normally just had one of these black beams, but I wanted to do the bridge. So what I'm going to do here is this uh, spin gear will interlock with the spin gear here. So I'm just going to pop this one on. Again, look how easy that is. So what I'm going to do is retract this all, all the way back. I'm going to go to the bridge, knock the bridge over this way, go past the bridge and knock it back over. So this one can just swing side to side. So let's go ahead and check that one out. So we'll knock it over that way and flips it back the other way. Pretty cool, huh? So that's just, again, another variation of the Educator++ Plus Plus, the front end attachment here, where this can now swivel side to side instead of up and down. Okay, guys, so come on, this guy is so cool. And I have not had any issues. You guys know I put brand new motors on this thing. It drives so straight. 
So, I don't know, guys. If you're looking for a first Lego League robot, this guy is, this guy's got it. Um, again, dual color sensor. I, I did not plug this one in yet because I'm not really using it yet. Um, and again, the wheels get supported on both sides. So I really love that. Helps the robot to drive straight. And these attachments, I cannot even tell you how cool these attachments are. They work really well and I don't know. I can't say enough about it. I love this robot, okay guys? So hopefully you are enjoying the start of your season if you guys have not started yet to plan for it. If you need a bot, this guy, again, I keep harping on it, but he's really cool. Okay guys, I am Mr. Hino from Seals Lego Robotics. I am out. He's out. He's out. We got this. We got this. We got this, guys. Hey guys, Mr. Hino here. Thank you so much for watching. And if you love robotics, don't forget to check out these videos also because they're cool. Okay, guys? Take care.